guys, I'm back. We are headed up towards Windhelm. Here we go. I don't, I definitely have never taken this path before, by the way. Sorry, I was adjusting my headphones. I needed both hands so I couldn't keep walking. <laughs> I can't walk and use my hands at the same time. That's kind of true. In a lot of ways that that's true. You know what I mean? All right, so we're close to a cave. What is that? Oh, that's just a, where's this cave? I want to discover the cave. Oh, it must be like right here. That's a goat, okay. What is this place? Oh. Crag Wallow Slope. Okay, so there was a demon cat. Okay, so Lydia, I think, has. I've got your back. I need to get her Let's a get curing going, disease then. thing because I think she caught something from. Okay, so I want to find that. Uh, there it is. I want to find the conjurer that this person or that this guy was fighting. And I did. That was a man. I was expecting that to be a woman. Ooh, here's an, a deer. Not an elk, a deer. Excuse me. Sorry. I, what? So is that, where, I thought I was headed towards a, I thought I was headed towards an orc hold. Yeah, okay, it just like totally had disappeared. We're just gonna go off country for a while. Cause there's a mine up here that I wanna discover if I can. I bet it's up there. Maybe, I don't know. Yeah, it's definitely up there. I wonder how you get to it. Probably by that road. Okay. Well, we're pretty close to that road. Maybe we can find it. Oh. Uh, maybe not. Okay, so... <clears throat> Clearly those orcs have claimed that mine. So we're just gonna sneak up here and discover the orc stronghold, which may or may not be difficult. I don't remember if these are hostile orcs or not. Most of the orc strongholds, like, there are... I don't know how many there are. I think there are like four or five, maybe? But, um... A few of them have things that they need help with. I really want to discover it, but I don't want to get too close in case they want to kill me. I'm so close. Halt, Outlander. Ah, okay. By the code of Malakath, this stronghold belongs to the orcs. Of course. Your kind are unwelcome. Uh, I'm just a traveler. What is this place? This is our stronghold. Here. We are free to live as Malakath intended, away from the prying eyes of the Nords. You're not an orc or bloodkin, so stay out. We only help our own. Uh, how can I convince you to let me in? Hmm. We've heard whispers of an enchanted pair of gauntlets, hidden and protected by dangerous men, beasts, or worse. They are called the Forge Master's Fingers. Bring them to our chief, and he will decide if you are worthy to be bloodkin to the orcs. I'll find those gauntlets. We will see. Yeah. Okay, well, I still want to discover. 
the place. Narzalbur. Narzalbur. That's what it's called. Now see, she says Forge Master's Fingers, and I'm like, I want those for myself. Because those that's an amazing name. That's a really cool name. And you know that they would make your smithing amazing. Well, amazing for my level. I don't know, they might do like 25% better smithing. Okay, so I know where we are now. We're pretty close to Kynes Grove. Which means we're pretty close to Windhelm. I mean, can you imagine, like, growing up with this mound? Just, like, just a little bit, uh, well, really, it's on a cliff. It's on a cliff that's overhanging this little village. I don't even know why they settled there. Oh, there's a mine. That's probably it. It's probably because of the mine. So, yeah. Did I? I opened my timer, but I don't know if I started it. I did not. Well... Start it. More tapanella. Oh, this is a cool mine. It's got malachite there. Grove. Maybe we should go in the inn. Should we go in the inn? I don't know. Hmm. This is the Braidwood Inn, which is actually a really cool name. I didn't have to look at the sign. I could have just walked up to the door. Shh. Come on in. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat. And hey, the keep your hands to yourself. You got it. Let's Poor see. Rogi. If you're feeling charitable, buy the Nordam mead. He's good for it. Uh, what do you mean he's good for it? Uh, who's he's Rogi? He's been in Kynes Grove forever. Great storyteller. Keeps everyone's spirits up. Owes me a lot of coin for drinks. I keep telling him not to worry about it, but he's got the stubborn Nord blood. Damn fool doesn't have the coin to pay me back, so he just beats himself up over it, and then he gets thirsty, and it cycles all over again. <laughs> uh, what if I talk to Rogi? If you could convince him that I don't care about his tab, it'd certainly make me feel better. Um, okay. We'll go do that real quick. All right, then. Why not? Right? Uh, that's a kid. Aw, she's so cute. Okay. Rogi. He's good for it. I don't know what that means. Because obviously he's not good for it. And, oh. and if I'm being charitable, I'm not expecting him to pay me back anyway. So, that was a confusing thing to say. Is this him? That's killed the younger. Jimma Uriel. Gana Uriel. Um, is this you? Rogi if you bring me, you're welcome here. Ah, even if you don't, you're still welcome. Idra wants you to forget about all that coin you owe. What do you think I am? A beggar? My family has always paid back every single coin we owe. His name Going is back not to Tiber Septum's time. And his beard is in a knot. Uh, let's see. I want to work on my persuade, so we'll do this. Stop being stubborn. Let it go. No. I have Jeez, at least I have pride. a horrible persuasion right now. Um, I can probably brawl. Maybe that would help. Uh, do I need to beat some sense into you? What? No. Uh, <laughs> all right. I won't worry about the coin anymore. <laughs> Great. Just so I'm intimidating. Stop giving me that look. I need to get my persuasion up clearly. How do you know so much about mead? Well, a lifetime of study, you might say. <laughs> a lifetime of the study. The best comes from Riften. But I haven't been there in years. Ever tried making your own? It's uh, no 
northeast. Trust me. That's funny. Uh, okay. Good to know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I like how your name is not Beard and your beard is in a knot. Nope. That one was not letting me pick it up. Now we are almost to Windhelm. Not that we needed to discover Windhelm, I just thought, you know, we haven't been there before. What's this? This is a mill. Why is there a mill here? What is this? I don't think I've ever seen this before. Yeah. I think that's some mod that I've installed that I don't know about. Probably. Because it's not on the map. So many ingredients. Guys, oh my goodness. Ugh, finally. Oh yeah, that's right, we took a boat to Windhelm last time. We didn't come in this way. I forgot about the boat. Windhelm stables. Who is that? Who is that? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a traveling merchant. What now? Are all the orc strongholds guarded? The strongholds keep to themselves. Skyrim hasn't always been kind to the orcs. Ah. For an outsider like you to be accepted, an orc would have to make you bloodkin and send word to the chiefs. Can you make me bloodkin? Trust like that is not freely given. That's funny. I've Until never... next time. That's funny. At least she didn't get mad at me for asking. That's nice. <sighs> I don't even know what we have to do once we get into Windhelm. I just thought we're supposed to do something in Windhelm. And then we have to go to the complete other side of Skyrim and do something in Solitude. I only think farther away from Windhelm than Solitude is Markarth. It's not giving me any pictures. Just smoke. There we go. Okay. Uh, let's see now. Hmm. The shill job. Oh! So I have the stolen silver ruby ring. Okay, well let's go ahead and turn that on. Okay. It is this direction. Well, I mean, I know where. Once you get used to Windhelm, this is like the market area. You've got the market stalls. The potion shop and the forge. Spare a coin for a poor old woman. And then you have the grave area. And this is where the rich people live. And then there are other places where the not rich people live. But basically the rich people are Viola Giordano. Like Shatter Shield House. And I don't know who lives here. Cruelty. Yeah. And then this is a named house, Hiram, which is probably one of my favorite vanilla Skyrim houses, Hiram, for sure. Oh, you know what? I'm going to sneak while I do this, while I use my horrible... Look, guys, we're almost getting up to a normal level. Horrible. Oh, I only have 11 left. But at least I'm in a town where I can go buy more. <gasps> well, I found it. Ah, that was so close. Why couldn't you just have given it to me? No.
did it. Bam! It only took me four lockpicks to do an expert lock. I need to level up. Okay, where am I supposed oh. to plant it? Upstairs. I think the stairs are... Where are the stairs? I don't know. I'm not there. Where are the stairs? How do you get upstairs? Oh, here they are. <sighs> Who is this? Nilsine Shatter Shield. Um, let's see, it's gonna be on apparel and it's a stolen silver ruby ring. Okay. I probably could no, I won't. I'm glad everyone was sleeping. It's just awkward when you gotta do stuff and everyone's like sitting in their chairs around the fire and they're like, you're not supposed to be here. It's like, yeah, but maybe you could just let me. Okay, we'll just fast travel to solitude. Fast, ooh, what's this? Shrouded Grove. Why is that on my map and undiscovered? Okay, so I have to pickpocket someone in solitude. I think I could do it. <gasps> These loading screens. I'm sorry, guys. I'm super sleepy. Uh, don't need to be sneaking. This is true. Let's see. Not what I wanted to do. Excuse me. Let's see. From Jala. I don't know who Jala is. I've got weapons forgiven and armor forgotten. Let's see. Pardon me. Jala. I don't know who Jala is. Oh, there she is. Well, this isn't suspicious. Well, she's detecting us, so this isn't this isn't gonna work. But I gotta see where she's going. What am I supposed to steal from her? No, wrong one. Her garnet. I might have to wait until it's night and she's like sleeping or something. Or if I can't figure out where she's going extremely slowly. She's going extremely slowly. Uh, is it this? Yes, okay. Now I'm walking. She's walking a little bit faster than I'm walking, but much slower than I'm running. So she's just gonna come hang out over here. Maybe I shouldn't do the pickpocket jobs anymore, huh? Oh, she's gonna go she's gonna go be in her stall. She has a little stall, I guess. It's like first thing in the morning. Who is noticing me? That guy. I totally should have uh, saved first. He's just like looking at me like, what are you doing over there? Would you stop accusing me like that? This is really, really difficult. I think we're gonna have to wait until nighttime. We got it. All right, 
back to Riften, and then we'll speak to Maven. Sorex Vinius. Um, let's see. Back to Riften. Riften is all the way down here. I guess Riften and Solitude are pretty far apart. So I've still got to stop by Morthal and Falkreath and Markarth. Have I been? I haven't been to Markarth. Oh, these things are pretty cool. Okay. Oh, that looks. These traveling merchants are always running. It's kind of creepy. Mm-hmm. Didn't I get you arrested, Branche? Has it already been like the 30 days or something? Can I interest you in some fine goods from Morrowind? Protect yourself right. Buy armor from Grelka. All right, we're going to go down in here. So we're returning to Vex, and we're returning to Delvin, and then we're going to go talk to Maven. That'll be fun. Don't you know? Pull up a seat. Have a drink. Uh, I've completed the fishing job. Ooh, nicely done. Here's your share. I forgot about the Queen Bee statue. I'm not gonna sell it to you, sorry. Hey, this guild needs the coin. Walking away without taking work is not gonna make you popular around here. Right, I forgot. I don't know though, because I have... Steal anything worth talking about? I've completed the shill job. And with no strings attached. Not bad. Here, got some coin for you. Um, let's see. Okay, I hear you're offering extra work. I handle the burglary, shell, sweep, and heist jobs. Most of them involve breaking and entering. If you don't like that kind of work, talk to Delvin. He runs the more up-close and personal jobs. Yeah, you say that every time. Um, tell me about the sweep jobs. One of the quickest ways to make some coin in Skyrim is to clear out some of the wealthier homes of their valuables. If you're interested, I could point out a good place that could use a little... House cleaning. Yeah. What do you say? I'll get right on it. Fine. Here's everything you need to know. So I'm really hoping it's either in Windhelm or Solitude again. Windhelm. Yay. All right. Give me something, Delvin. Need some gold. I may have some work for you. I heard you're offering I extra work. Gold fishing, from you. And bedlam jobs. The ones with a more personal touch. Mm -hmm. If break-ins are more your thing, go talk to Vex. Uh, tell me about the Bedlam jobs. Sometimes we just like to remind a city that we mean business, so we hit them hard. Just steal whatever we can until we made an impression. Oh, how funny. Simple, right? Almost. The catch is, it doesn't count if anyone sees you take it. The message needs to be clear. We work in the shadows. Steal from anywhere in the hold. And you even get to keep everything you stole. So, you in? I'll take it. Just remember the rules. Keep it clean and keep it quiet. Here's the details. Let's see, where am I, where am I going? Windhelm. Awesome. Alright. So, I think I'm going to go ahead and stop there. Uh... We've been going for plenty of time. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for hanging out. Um, thanks for watching. See ya.